Hey there, Selective Collective, because this is for the people that have chose to click on this video. So, um, <clears throat> I'm going to sing something, but it's not, it's not to display a voice, okay? I'm really, I'm wanting you to hear the words of this song, because some might know this song. It's very, I think it's really important for today. Um, maybe dealt with different issues when it was, of course, um, when it came out. The song is called Signs from the Five Man Electric Band. Uh, originally during the time of uh, Vietnam War and protest and things like that. But I think it's really important today, too. And I remember I used to listen to this song when I was like 16. I'm pretty sure my dad had it on some kind of protest song tape and I probably took it from him and played it in my car but anyway so the words are important okay so it says and the sun said long-haired freaky people need not apply so I tucked my hair up under my hat and I went in to ask him why he said you look like a fine upstanding young man I think you'll do so I took off my hat, I said, imagine that. Huh, me, working for you. Sign, sign, everywhere sign. Blocking out the scenery, brick in my mind. Do this, don't do that, can't you read the sign? And the sign said, anybody caught trespassing will be shot on sight. So I jumped on top of the fence and I yelled at the house, what gives you the right? To put up a fence to keep me out, but keep Mother Nature in. If God was here, he'd tell you to your face, man, you're some kind of sinner. Sign, sign, everywhere sign. Blocking out the scenery, breaking my mind. Do this, don't do that, can't you read the sign? Now, hey, you mister, can't you read? You got to have a shirt and tie to get a seat. You can't even watch. No, you can't eat. Because you ain't supposed to be here. And the sign said, you got to have a membership card to get inside. And it goes, huh, and then it goes on. It says, <clears throat> so the sign said, everybody welcome to come in and kneel down and pray. But when they passed around the plate at the end of it all, I didn't have a penny to pay. So I got me a pen and a paper and I made up my own little sign. I said, thank you, Lord, for thinking about me. I'm alive and doing fine. Sign, sign, everywhere sign. Okay, so you get it, right? Ah, that song is so electric. It just gets me all fired up just even singing about it. So yeah, it's about... um. Everybody has some kind of sign that they would like to put up. Everybody has some kind of restriction that they would like to, you know what I mean? So anyway, I know that wasn't, that was not to display voice, but it, <laughs> electric, what did I say? Electric. The words are um, absolutely electric in that song. And that, that's the point is the, the words, right? So you give them credit. Um, five five man five man band five band ele five man electric band five being a catalyst for change and yeah they definitely were during that time and apparently they still still are like right now so i have uranus here this is a card of oh wow big it's eccentric it's like a lightning bolt of change um what I'm feeling today. I'm like, Ugh. I'm just feeling a lot of like electricity energy today. Um, whatever this is, this is big. It is big. It is bringing in drastic change. Could come to you as, as like an idea or something like that. I don't, I don't know. It's electric. Like I said, this energy is electric. Please don't judge me on the voice either because that, it's just for the words. Okay. Synchronicities. Well, look, those that's about signs. <laughs> that's about you getting signs. Okay. So there you go. Um, synchronicity, signs. 
you are the diamond. You have been under pressure. That's how you became the diamond. All of the pressure that you have overcome. It, there's some kind of drastic change, drastic shakeup with the uh, Uranus card. Or what I, I, do proper people say? The Uranus. <laughs> I don't know. I've always heard it. I'm just joking, by the way, if you say it like that. I'm just joking. And the blood, okay, this, so it's like feeling alive, it's alive, and then the energy of the, like this electricity, and then seeing signs and synchronicities, it's right in the middle. Thank you, Spirit, for cooperating with me with this song, too, I appreciate that. And then the alchemical wedding, a reason to celebrate, we're transcending signs, we're transcending signs, wanting signs from the divine, less signs from everybody else. <laughs> More signs from the divine. <clears throat> okay. Let's see what other signs you might want to give this group, this collective. The blood card means that something's coming alive online alive feeling alive a red rose could be symbolizing of, of some type of love coming into your life i hope love is already in your life for yourself but this is the type that would make you feel more alive than you did the day before that's the best way i could describe that and also the creative juices are like flowing with no fear of looking stupid i mean come on look what i do on here like every day every day no fear of looking stupid, because if you do, oh well, so authentically you, then sometimes authentically we do look a little stupid, right? Um, uncertain. At this time, the situation or outcome is uncertain. Why? Why is it uncertain? Is something going to require travel? Okay, uh... Overcoming, rise above, freedom, breaking free. Oh, this is about, uh, well, I already know that this is a collective message anyway, but this is about the collective and the whole of um, breaking free from big time control, listening to your internal guidance system. It's going to be a collective effort. I mean, it, I'm not saying things that are... So this is spirit saying, like, it could go either way. But you are seeing the synchronicities for an energy that's saying, here, we, we beckon you towards drastic change, towards being eccentric, towards being um, authentic. Whoa. There's a worry. Okay, that is... Uh, yeah, this worry energy... Is, <clears throat> is a tactic. It feels like a tactic that keeps people controlled, that controls people. Honestly, it's part of like a fear virus. I, I like the way that that's worded. It's part of a fear virus because if I can make you worry about whether or not you're going to make it next week, um, maybe you'll forget that you're divine and eternal. <laughs> like, you know, if, if I... If I make you worry more about, and I make you rely on me for everything, then I've got fear and worry installed in you, and that's a form of control. So on the collective, I'm like looking at a dog shaking off water and in my mind's eye, and that's what we have to do with worry, is we have to like um, shake it off somehow. Shake it off. I have library, knowledge, learning, history, information, research, books, pastime, archives, hidden things, secrets, and then overcome. Another card that says to overcome. You can overcome this. There's an opportunity to overcome in the midst of a hardship. And there are a lot of people going through hardship right now. In one way or another, 
someone's going through a hardship. But there's something about this main worry or constraint, uh, some type of control about that. Youth, mutable, breaking free. And that's what you're here to do. You're here to try things out, something new, to be flexible, but ultimately to break free, to break free, to break free and overcome the uncertain energy is only tied to the worry because the misfortune or the steps back or the trials you can certainly overcome it is the energies of fear and worry and uncertainty itself okay bedroom on the bottom um about intimacy Okay, mature man, you have gift. A little bit different than the Ace of Pentacles because this is like a gift, but it's, it's with two hands. Have lovers. Looks like it's in the reverse, but I'm gonna I'm gonna set it up right so we can see it. it. It definitely has the same colors of this uncertain card. So there might be uncertain, like a uncertainty tied around a, a very major decision for yourself or for you to make for yourself a major decision. Revert to old, revert to the old way or try something drastically new, new, the child, something new. Concern, 33. Mas Ascendant Master Energy, Master Number 33. Also, the Trinity, Creation. Okay, that's too many. Sorry. Oh, a thief card. What was taken from you or what kind of deception? And then community. Some of you all it has to do with the community that you're in. Or change it is something to do with changing the environment due to some kind of deception that was around it or of being associated with some kind of deception in a community and then sudden wealth on the bottom crossroads and the moon so changes fame recognition A good outcome. Secrets being revealed. The book in reverse. Secrets being revealed and a, and a good outcome is popping out. Especially over this broken vase, hardship, misfortune. Oh, shit. Oh, it got stuck on my um, pant. The cat, your ally, your friend, your familiar. A letter here. Written communication and definitely some change coming into your life somehow, some way. Mm. You've got to break free. Change, change is what's necessary. This voyage has not even yet, is yet to come, right? But you have to break free. Present the, the mind, the thoughts, the worry, the deception. Breaking free. be getting signs about how to um, go on this path that leads you somewhere just completely different than where you're at right now the eight of cups moving away from dissatisfaction something new ace of wands something new inspirational inspiring this might have something to do with this card on the bottom 
bedroom, sexual fulfillment, intimacy, sensual pleasure. That card sometimes is related to that. Um, this might be about taking time out, though, for to gather inspiration for what it is you're working on or something like that. Healing your heart space. Healing more than just your heart. Mind, body, soul. Taking time out. Rest, contemplation, prayer. Letting go of the past. Five of Cups. Letting go of the worry. Letting go of the past. And then Page of Cups upright has to do with it, accepting this. Um, it's like a... could be a secret admirer for some, right? It can be that. It can also be like a makeover for your job. The fresh new start. Something that you're doing that is actually going to bring joy or fun. Think of this as like... Think of something as a fresh start. Something loving. Something maybe you've not experienced. It's just the beginning. It's just the beginning. And you'll have celebration, fun, dancing, joy, abundance. Breaking free from the abuse of powers in authority, in authority or that have authoritative control over the worry factor, the fear factor. Yep. That's what I've got, guys. Listen to your intuition. It is time. Time is up to listen to your intuition and go in a direction where um, you feel you're intuitively being guided. Okay? And your message. Wow, nice. 777 seven, seven, and zero. Zero, there is no beginning and no end. All is infinite. It is time to develop your spiritual side. You are gaining new sight and understanding of both godly and earthly things. I am limitless. 777, your purpose flows from within you. Everything that is unfolding or being revealed to you is part of your purpose. A state of peace and calmness in your soul. I am in flow, 777. So I love this for you all. I hope you enjoyed that. Definitely signs here and synchronicities and big change should you want it. And um, a big message to shake off the worry like a dog shaking the wet off of its back. All right, sending you love. Bye-bye.